Hey guys, what's up? Today I'll be showing you how to jailbreak and unlock the iPhone 4 running 4.2.1. Now basically, we're using Ponish Tool for the Mac. You could use Snow Breeze for the Windows if you're on a Windows computer. But basically, how this jailbreak works is uh, you have to be on a preserved baseband, which is for the unlock. So if you're on iPhone 4, you have to be running 01.59.00 baseband. I'll show you that in a second here the baseband right there you have to be running that right there if you're not then you cannot unlock the phone because basically you're using Ponish tool it preserves the baseband meaning it doesn't update it with the new firmware so you can use the ultra snow unlock from Cydia so let's get into this first you're gonna download Ponish tool link in the down there description and also you're gonna download your firmware for your device which is on this website link will also be down in the description Go ahead and select iPhone 4, iPhone 4, 4.2.1, hit that, download it, um, and save it to your desktop or wherever you want. Then open up Ponage Tool right here. Alright, same interface, just updated version. Select the device, go ahead into expert mode actually. Expert mode, select your device, hit next, and then browse, browse for your IPSW file. Go ahead and select it. Take a second to load. All right, here gonna hit general and activate the phone. If you're not using, uh, on, if you don't rely on unlock, then you don't need to click this. But if you do, like me, go ahead and hit activate the phone. And you can also set a partition for the jailbreak. Um, doesn't really matter. Hit next. Um, I wouldn't recommend uh, installing any um, packages because that tends to mess up uh, some of the process while installing the firmware but just hit next and make sure CD installer is ticked and then you hit build hit next and it's gonna ask you what to save it as so basically um, I tend to save it something else so iPhone 4 jailbreak 4.2.1 and then hit save to wherever you want um, I usually save it to my desktop and then it will be done but I'm gonna cancel this since I've already done the jailbreak Next, once this is all done, it should take about 5 to 10 minutes, um, depending on your computer speed. Then after that, it's going to ask you to put your iPhone into DFU mode. If you don't know how to do that, it gives you a step, but I'm just going to show you anyways, if you still can follow the steps. It's pretty basic, but home button and power button for 10 seconds, hold that. After 10 seconds, release the power button as keep holding the home button for another 10 seconds. Then iTunes will automatically pop up saying your iPhone is in D or uh, recovery mode, and then you'll have the two options to um, check for updates and restore. For the Mac, you're gonna hit Alt and Option on the keyboard and click Restore. Then you'll get your Finder. But uh, for Windows, you're gonna hit Shift and Restore, and then you'll find your IPSW. But then click your IPSW, the one that I named um, iPhone 4 4.2.1 jailbreak. I didn't make the IPSW file, so it's not here. But you would normally click that and then hit choose. Takes another five minutes to do the thing, uh, to do the uh, firmware bundle, and then then you'll see Cydia on your iPhone 4. Go ahead and click that. Wait for it to load, or as you can see. And you basically want to go into manage, manage on the bottom, sources, edit, add, and you want to add repo six 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 dot ultra snow and the zero and the O in snow is actually a zero, and dot com. So that is the repo. I don't know if you can guys see see that, but you just add that, and you will install the only source that's there, the only package that's there, and then. That's pretty much it. You'll have an unlocked phone. This is originally a uh, AT&T phone. As you can see, I'm using Fido right there. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace. I had a dream I could buy my way to heaven. When I woke, I smit that on a necklace. I told God I'd be back in a second. Man, it's so hard not to act reckless.